Here we have a CAT 6A shielded cable with a UFTP construction, also called PIMF or pairs in metal foil. With the Category 6A strip tool, set the proper depth for the cable you're using and go once around so you don't cut into the conductors or foil. Next, break and remove the jacket. Pull back the strip string and cut it off with a flush cutter. With this cable construction, you will see each twisted pair has its own foil. Individually open up each foil and spare them back flat along the cable jacket. Use a half twist to ensure the metal side of the foil is facing outward. Next, spare back the drain wire, laying it back along the foil. You will see that the wire manager label has T568A and B wiring options, and the wire manager has triangular drain wire capture slots below the blue and green. Inside the wire manager, there are grounding springs, as well as a post that will line up with the strip point of the cable. Pull the drain wire close to either the blue or green twisted pair, whichever is closest. Then line the wire manager with the corresponding colored pair and snap it shut. Seat each pair into its wiring slot, untwisting the pair to ensure the center element is completely visible. There shouldn't be any pair crossovers at that point. Do a quick polarity check to make sure the white wire of each pair is closest to the guide pin hole. Using flush cutters, trim all pairs so they are flush with the sides of the wire manager. Tug the drain wire into the triangular capture slot and cut it flush with the sides of the wire manager. Now nip the foil at the rear of the wire manager with your flush cutters and tear it away. Line the up indication on the wire manager with the up indication molded on the connector and insert the wire manager into the connector. Then to complete termination, just close the rear doors. For more information, please visit levitin.com slash atlasx1.